How you guys doing today? Welcome to Raven's Nest. Just keep flocking in. Keep flying in. Thank you for joining me. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Because if you don't hit the subscribe button, how are we supposed to know you're loyal to this nest? We already got some subscribers already. We got 10 of them. 10 loyal Ravens fans has co have come through to Raven's Nest. We're so appreciative for that. Listen, we're trying to make this nest go big. We're trying to make this the biggest Raven's flock. The biggest Raven's nest in the entire world. Okay, so keep coming in. Make sure you just keep coming. Just keep coming. And also, send me your questions at NFLRavensNest at gmail.com. And your questions might end up on the show. So, listen. Today, we're going to talk about our Baltimore Ravens again, as usual. N nothing new there, right? So, we're going to talk about Terrence West is injured. He has a calf injury. I'm sure you all you guys know. And he's expected to miss an extended period of time. Obviously, John Harbaugh doesn't like to come out anymore, guys. He, he doesn't say anymore how long players are going to be out. He's a veteran coach. He knows better now, right? So he's not going to say that. He's got the calf injury. I'm suspecting he's going to miss three to four weeks, possibly. We really don't know. But that's, I mean, some guys might say that's our starting running back. It's not good that he's out. But Terrence West is just slowly being pushed down the roster, guys, okay? Obviously, He's not my favorite running back. I've made that clear, okay? He, next time you watch Terrence West, watch his vision whenever he runs, whenever he comes back. Make sure you, you just watch that, okay? He has bad vision. He doesn't even watch where he's going. A lot of times he runs straight into offensive linemen. He has open holes, open gaps, and he doesn't shoot up the gap. He just goes the other way. I don't know what's up with that, but obviously you can't expect much out of Terrence West. Obviously a, a big guy. Okay, he's a little too big to be playing the running back position and being an every down back. He's a good power back, good on third and one, third and two, fourth and goal situations, stuff like that. That's good for him, but he's not your every down back like the Ravens have tried to use him. Although he is a hometown guy, he's from Townsend, we've got to love him, he is a Raven. I don't want to bash him too much on the show, but I am saying that to say that there's other guys on the roster who I like better than Terrence West. And even though we traveled west to Oakland, we were okay without West last week. We ran for over 100 yards on the ground between Buck Allen, who I see good things out of him this year, and also Alex Collins, who really just came out of nowhere. And I know we've talked about Alex Collins a lot on this show, but we're going to continue to talk about him because he is one of my favorite, and I hope he's one of the Ravens' favorites too, and one of you guys' favorites because from what I've heard, a lot of guys, a lot of Ravens fans, men and women, love Alex Collins, for sure, because he is a beast. He came out of nowhere, like I said. He came out the practice squad, and he's he has 7.8 yards per carry this season. He had 11 carries last week for, for about 55 yards, so Alex Collins is making the most of his opportunities, and last week he didn't even fumble the football, so that was good. Buck Allen, again, he did good. He had 19, he had 21 carries. And he had 70-something yards. Can't remember the stats off the top of my head, okay? <laughs> Don't roast me in the comments below. That's okay. But anyway, remember that we need to use Alex Collins. Terrence West will be fine without him. Don't worry about it. But what we should worry about is the offensive lineman, Matt Skura. He's out for an extended period of time because he got a MCL sprain. He'll be out from two to three weeks, something like that. And obviously, this all ties into our running game because obviously, we all know Matt, we traded for Matt Skura right before the season because Alex Lewis got lost to injury. We lost Ricky Wagner, the free agency. Now Marshall Yonda's out. Now Matt Skura's out. I mean, what's next? Ronnie Stanley? I don't want, I hope not. I mean, our Ravens just keep getting hurt, guys. I mean, let me know what the net, how the Nest feels about this, about this, the, all these injuries. It's just really unfortunate. It makes me so upset to hear all these injuries. That's kind of what I came to talk to you guys about today. Just more injuries. Let's just hope we can stay healthy as Ravens. I appreciate you guys coming through today. Keep flocking into Ravens Nest. Keep coming in. All you lone birds, keep coming to Ravens Nest. You guys have a good Baltimore Raven day. See you guys later.